welcome to my channel. I'm gonna be doing a review of something you've probably heard about and probably have seen a lot of which is a wig review from Uvini. Quick disclaimer, they did not send me this stuff. It's not sponsored, no nothing like that. I was really inspired by Alexa Poletti's video and it kind of urged me to try their wigs out because they are pretty inexpensive and I wanted to get at least one of the wigs. I've never gotten anything from Uvimi and I decided that you guys should see my impressions and if it's good. So I'm really excited. I have high hopes. So this is the packaging that it came with. It has the Uvimi logo, which is a beret. And with their super cute lettering and just pink aesthetic in general, is really nice already. They really put a nice touch on their packaging, which they didn't have to, but they still do. And it just has the wig on the back. It's called like Harajuku Lolita. Um, what is it called? I took a picture of it. But it's called Harajuku Lolita Wig with two small buns and it retails for $47 but I got it for $33. I believe it's a sale right now but it's this wig right here. It is like a short um, wig with little small buns on each side and I got the color linen brown. I decided to go with this one because it's more natural and looking at it right now it's not like the cosplay blonde it's like natural color blonde which is nice because you can wear this outside and it comes in like a ziplock type of opening which protects your product they give you a free wig cap it's a black one um sorry if my light keeps reflecting but this is what it looks like and the main wig comes in a separate bag the buns come in this really cute small bag and as you can see there's like a net that protects the buns so it's kind of like not too loose and it won't lose its shape we're gonna try this on and we're gonna see how it looks like we have our wig cap on and we look extra cute i did my makeup really extra today by the way because i know i'm gonna be wearing a wig and it looks nicer with some extra makeup and yeah, hopefully this one holds. It looks really natural. It's like a strawberry blonde. I don't have a mirror in front of me, so it might not align pretty well, so forgive me for that. Okay, it's really, really soft, and I can already tell it's really nice. I am afraid about the bangs part because it looks really thin, um, but it's really, really soft. And the netting is something that I've never really seen before. It's like a brown lace it's not a lace front wig but it's like brown lace with high quality netting and of course here are like the straps so you can adjust the size there's no clips on this or anything to secure it in place which is i guess not too much of a problem it's just my hair is pretty thick so a little bit of security would be nice but i can just always um, buy those clips like she said, and put it on the wig itself. So it does need some adjusting, so I'll be right back. This is the best I can do for right now, but it's so pretty, it's so nice. I really like the color. Um, the camera, honestly, is not doing justice to how natural it looks personally, because it still like shines a little bit because of my ring light. And it's a really nice blonde. As I said, the front part is very thin. So it, it kind of shows your hairnet if it's like a dark hairnet. I don't really own anything like a beige color um, hairnet. So I can't switch it out. But I still love it nonetheless. It gives like a really fun um, character out. And I just really love it on. It's very comfortable. It hugs your whole hair which is good. I do need to clip the bottom part on because I do have like a bun of a bun of hair right here and it's actually kind of lifting it up because I do have a very thick hair so clips would help and that would secure all that problem I really love it I might get the other colors or just I'm in love I'm in love with their wigs yeah this is what it looks close up uh, this could honestly pass as a toga wig or like a other type of cosplays because it's really nice 
really like it. I'm gonna keep saying that, but we're gonna try out the buns. Fun time. Uh, okay, this is pretty secured. And they're like the clip-on type, like it's a clamp, which is nice. It's very easy. This is what the bun looks like. It's nicely made. And does it match? Yeah, it matches. And we're just gonna put one here. Um, I need to look at the mirror. Okay, so this is how it turned out. Um, the clamps are really hard to open actually, so I kind of busted one out. and. The hair just kind of comes loose, but you can always fix that with hairspray. Um, this one looks perfect still. I am in love with this wig so much. The front part is very thin. That's the only downside of this wig, but it's comfortable. It's it's natural looking, and it's really soft. It's pretty obvious that I recommend this wig a lot. I will leave this same exact wig down below if you're interested on getting this one. They do have other shade of color for this wig, but just the same style if you're interested with that. I'm probably gonna be wearing this a lot in the next couple of videos. I hope that's okay with you guys. But that's pretty much it as far as this wig goes. I will see you guys on my next video. Bye!